So I'm really excited and I'm and I ha I can picture the pictures in my head and I'm I'm really excited by the way these are gonna turn out. I am gonna put them here but I'm not gonna put all the pictures I take on because I want you guys to head over to my Instagram which is wheel and axle underscore official. So go ahead, check out my Instagram page and you'll see all the pictures there. I'm curious because I kinda have an idea of what I wanna do. Like I kinda wanna make a photography page, but I don't know how it's gonna work. I already have the idea of what I'm going to name it, but I don't know. I guess I'll uh, think about it all day and uh, figure it out. But for now, let me head over to Linden, pick up Mario, and then we're going to keep going exploring. Okay, now just to give you guys an update, the headliner is still not in the car. I still have the old shade. However, I do have the brand new black shade that I still need to get put on in there but in order for me to do that I gotta put the interior back together so like like I said earlier in the video due to all this uh, COVID-19 coronavirus stuff the uh, lady that was actually supposed to do it uh, she's backed up with a bunch of projects and I kind of don't want to like keep bugging her like hey get this headliner done only because it's because of the time and everything that's going on. I don't want I don't want to bug anyone. It's serious what's going on out there. So if you guys are going out, please be safe. Wash your hands, don't touch your face and always take a shower obviously whenever you get home because you don't want to catch anything out there and the it's getting pretty serious out there. And I'm going to be honest with you guys, uh in the state of New Jersey, everyone was supposed to reduce their staff by 50 percent and unfortunately i was a part of that 50 percent but don't worry my manager told me i still have my job it's just the fact that of the whole coronavirus stuff they have to reduce their staff but uh yeah so i'm gonna take the opportunity to where i am not working and kind of like create content for you guys and make sure that i get ahead of schedule and actually i have a little bit of good news the wide body might be coming a little bit sooner than expected because I've been talking to the company that creates the wide body and we kind of have uh, gotten to a little agreement so stay tuned I don't know it might be coming within uh, a month or so I also still need to get the uh, air suspensions and all that stuff but for now I'm gonna just have fun with the with the time that I have not being at work I'm gonna I'm gonna take the opportunity now that I'm not at work maybe tomorrow I'm gonna make another video but that will probably be out in like another week or so basically what I'm just gonna do is I'm just gonna clean the car do the detail I'm kind of gonna go a little bit overboard with the detail because I kind of want to clean the suspensions because I do plan on selling those in order to get the air suspension and uh Oh man, I'm excited. This year is going to be the year I finally do what I wanted to do to this car. And I'm hoping and I'm crossing my fingers that I have the opportunity to get more sponsors and that this channel blows up so that way I can finally do something that I've been planning on doing. And I'm really excited. I am really excited. And I also plan on like going down to Florida kind of like meeting up with some fans there like just basically exploring i want to 
because I've only ever really been to New York and New Jersey and Pennsylvania, but I haven't went far into Pennsylvania. So I want to go and meet other people. I want to explore, see different places. I want to take pictures. I want to be able to do something that I love and making YouTube videos is honestly something that brings out the joy in me. I gotta make a video about a car that has been the most reliable car that I have ever owned. Yes, I did blow the engine, but it wasn't my fault, but I'm really excited by the way things are turning out. And even though I did lose my job or I got laid off temporarily, I'm gonna take that opportunity to kind of like push and push on this channel so that way I bring content out to you guys I'm able to do something that I love and then maybe when all this blows off I don't have to go back to work and this will be my full-time job but I'm probably thinking a little bit too high but I'm just I'm just happy that I can record a video give it out to you guys and actually we broke 200 subscribers I know 200 subscribers is not a lot but it's a lot to me that's 200 people that are watching my content and I'm just an idiot with the Volkswagen and you guys like it so um yeah I'm definitely gonna bring more content for you guys all right so let me not keep Mario waiting let me go ahead and uh, see him in London I'll, I'll cut to where I'm there you guys know what I mean all right I'll see you when I get there Gucci. Hi. Oh, oh, oh. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh, you got the pack. Snap pack. I'm just following you right there. Uh, yeah. You know where we're going? Huh? You know where we're going? Yeah, we're going to the spot by uh, Schwalmer, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright. All right. Cool. right safe. Yeah, we're just waiting for Mario right now. He got his bike, so I'm gonna take a picture of that. I'm gonna take a picture of my car and his bike together. I'm hoping that in the spot there aren't going to be uh, too many people because it's basically like a street. I, you guys will see when we get there it's basically kind of like a refinery kind of looking area so I want to take pictures there. I feel like it's going to look really good. Oh yeah. It's going to make for a really good picture. Mario, say what up? What's up? How oh. you doing? We're gonna be taking pictures of this sexy thing too. It's most likely gonna get more views than my car. <laughs> sexy ass bike. All right, so explain to people what kind of bike this is. This is a BMW S1000 RR, and as long as it's not racing one of those Italian fucking bullshit bikes or H2, I will beat anything on the street. So come at me, please. <laughs> Challenge accepted. Well, not with that thing at least. All right, so let me go ahead and look crazy to everyone. Let me smack this GoPro on my head and take some pictures. Yeah, we're gonna go over there. We're gonna try and see a couple of more spots. Oh, it's fucking cold. What? Uh, I wanna take a picture of my car here and then I wanna do your bike. I want you to hop it, and then I'm gonna tell you to move to the, a little bit to the left. Yep. to the next spot. Yes, sir. Alright, so we're at the next 
next spot. Woo! That spot looks good. <laughs> that spot looks real good. I need more low. I need more low. I need more low. I wish I had bags. I need bags, that's why. I haven't really had a chance to adjust it. Make it look like it's going faster than it is. Take your bike in between one. What, between the little tiny ones? Yeah. Huh. Now I gotta do all this. Hold on. I'm not, I'm not backing up. You go right there. Like that? Yep. And then here, let me turn it on. Get the fuck up out of here before they call cops. <laughs> and just like that, we are done. I drove absolutely everywhere to Linden, Roselle, Elizabeth, all the way back down to my house. Everywhere. I've been driving everywhere trying to find uh, different spots. I'm going to include some pictures in the video so that way you can see like where. And I'm not going to edit them. Uh, if you want to see the edited photos, make sure to go to my instagram once again it's going to be wheel and axle underscore official i'm going to post a link down in the description so yeah it was very eventful but there wasn't a lot to film so this vlog is going to be relatively short and i do apologize for that but i just wanted to bring you guys some content so i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like comment subscribe press the notification bell if you want to hear more from me and please 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 be safe out there. It is crazy and this whole thing with the coronavirus is just going to keep getting worse. So many people are affected by it, losing their jobs, having families to feed. I'm lucky enough to where I don't have any kids, but I do have to worry about my family. I got to worry about my girlfriend and her family. So please be safe, guys. There's a silver lining somewhere. You just got to wait it out. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. And I ain't with a lot of daddy. I just fucking leave my kids all in the bitch's body. I just wanna make it big and tell them that I'm sorry. Tell them that I never meant it, but I let a party. And I had to get it up, cause I love the hoe. Winning, I'm winning, but I'm winning more. I took her for ransom and ran from my brody.